Yo, 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 yo. What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Black Cheetah is A. Yeah, yeah. Man, 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 man. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. So today's video, you know, got some good information for some of y'all, especially a new Cubase users. You know when you mix your vocals, I'm going to show you how you send your delays and reverb as a FX channel. You know, when you mix your vocals on a vocal chain, don't put your delays and reverb on your vocal chain. You know, so like like this. Check this out. You see. Don't put your reverbs here it's on 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 your vocal chain, you know. Don't put your vocals here. I mean, don't put your delays and reverb on your vocal chain. So you need to use your delays and reverb as a send FX channel send. You send them as a FX channel. They must be here. You see, this is send, and this is insert you see so your delays and your reverbs must be on a on a send on this chain not not here so if you want to use if you want to use your vocal your delays and your reverbs as a fx channel the first thing that you're going to click you're going to click at the top there there is like a project there is a project you're going to click the project after clicking the project you're going to click on add track after clicking on add track you're going to click s you're going to click on fx channel here so this will pop up on your screen so after this you coming on you clicking on no effect here now you can choose your delay you see okay each delay yes you don't make changes to the to this delay yet you see you click here you cancel this then you come on your project again and click on add track after clicking on add track you're gonna click on fx channel then you come in here again no effect now you're going to select your reverb see okay let me just choose any reverb okay let's say this is my my my, my reverb then you see okay you don't make changes to this reverb okay you go into to click here on your vocals chain going to click here now you can click on this when you click on this empty thing this will pop up now you can choose your delay activate it okay now you can make changes to it listening to your vocal okay you can make changes to it listening get her a pop like seven a you see sabagari tang zari mengele ri tang zari mengele skim sam segele this is the amount room full of signal this is the amount guys this is the amount of your reverb if you want your reverb to be too much you can just you know drag this down i mean drag drag this to the left drag this to the right you know this is the amount same thing as a, a reverb you're going to do the same thing you see you see click here make changes to it don't use your delays and reverbs here on your vocal chain you know your reverbs and delays and other effects you can just use on this send you see if you want your vocals to be like modulated you can just use the effects here the reverbs here and delays here yes guys this is the end of this video i just wanted to show you like this you see i just wanted to show you this thing it's very important if you don't know you know it's very important so that you can have more space on your vocal chain to use effects or plugins on it so yes guys don't forget to subscribe i'm gonna see you in the next video ciao